here in western New York, and now there's a brand new brunch spot to try on Buffalo's west side. I love it when Tuilong goes to these places because then I go to those places <laughs> when I meet up with my friends. Perks Cafe, they recently opened in the Horse Feathers building. The restaurant's going to be the new anchor there, and the Buffalo Planning Board just approved its plans to serve alcohol. Perfect. So that's where Tuilong Nugent is this morning. She's live with a look at everything that they have to taste and see. Show it all off, Tuilong. We're hungry. Yeah, we love giving you guys brand new ideas of places to visit, especially in neighborhoods that are seeing a real revitalization, like here on the west side. There are a number of businesses that you may have known, but a lot more are popping up, and one of those is Perks. We have Julie, who's currently making us a latte to show off this morning, so you can see a little bit of everything they're giving. Look at how gorgeous that is. Julie, tell us a little bit about how this is going to differ from your Elmwood location, because you're offering a lot more. Um, Yeah, right now we do have a soft menu, but we are expanding every week. Um, we really want to amp up our breakfast and brunch options, especially with beer and wine coming soon. Um, so we've started doing some pancakes and we've got like a vegan breakfast sandwich. Obviously our regular breakfast sandwich, which is a big hit. Breakfast burritos all that kind of stuff. And you guys really want to be inclusive to everyone, not only in this neighborhood, but everyone who's coming here to visit and eat and drink from you, right? Yeah, absolutely. So we offer things like, you know, vegan cream cheese, um, milk alternatives for dairy-free allergy, um, stuff like that. So it's cool. <laughs> what has it been like joining the West Side here with so many new businesses and people that have been in the neighborhood who have kind of seen the highs and the lows and now kind of seeing the high again? <laughs> it's been great, especially, um, you know, on the market days on the weekend. We've seen a ton of people in here and it's really, it's really nice to see this area of Buffalo growing and doing so well. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> and if you have not been to the Horse Feathers Market before, there is a market indoor on Saturdays, so if you're looking to escape the cold, you can grab a <laughs> cup of coffee, a breakfast sandwich, and then walk around the market and enjoy yourself all indoors as it's getting a little <laughs> colder this winter. We're live here on Buffalo's West Side. I'm Tweela Nugent, 7 Eyewitness News. We keep talking about Horse Feathers and the Horse yeah, Feathers yeah. Market. Mm -hmm. It's in that building. That's on Connecticut Street. It's the old Martin Cook's, if you remember oh, yeah. that restaurant. Oh, yeah. So take a look. It's a really cool spot. Looks delicious. And just